वेलकम 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 गाइस बैक टू माय चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी विल टॉक बी टॉकिंग अबाउट वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन फॉर व्हाट वैल्यूज ऑफ के सिग्मा एन इज इक्वल टू वन टू के एन फैक्टोरियल समेशन इज अ परफेक्ट स्क्वायर सो यू गाइस मस्ट बी थिंकिंग वेयर एन फैक्टोरियल एंड ऑल दीज आर रिलेटेड टू परफेक्ट स्क्वायर एंड ऑल सो लेट्स जस्ट डीप डाइव इनटू इट वी विल मेक सम ऑब्जर्वेशंस इन इट सो फर्स्ट ऑब्जर्वेशन इज फॉर एन ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू 5 एन फैक्टोरियल हैज जीरो इन इट्स इनर्स प्लेस right because 5 factorial is 120 and any factorial ahead will just get multiplied by 120 so the units place will always remain zero second observation we make is like it's just a, not observation is a fact one one factorial plus two factorial plus three factorial plus four factorial is 33 1 plus 2 plus 6 plus 24 units place to note here is 3 And what happens for k greater than equal to five? It units place won't change because like adding five factorial, six factorial, seven factorial, everything units place is zero. So units place of the result won't change. It will still remain three. So units place of any uh, summation where k is greater than equal to five or four say units place is going to be three. And now comes the picture which relates it to perfect square. A perfect square have very specific unit places: zero, one, four, five, six, and nine. Numbers like two, numbers ending in two, three, seven, and eight cannot be perfect square. And our number, which is three, our summation always ends in three for k greater than equal to four. So our summation will always. Uh, have a units place three, so it cannot be perfect square for k greater than equal to four. So only remains the choice is k one to three. So for k is equal to one, it's just one factorial, so it's perfect square. For k is equal to two, it's one factorial plus two factorial. This three is not a perfect square. And for k is equal to three, it's one factorial plus two factorial plus three factorial, which is nine is a perfect square. So solution for this answer, uh, this question is basically. K one and K three satisfy this equation. No other integral, well, positive integral values of K satisfy this equation. That's it. Thank you, guys.